Be right here, Buzz TV. It's a fun night. It's Friday, and look who we caught up with. Our number two artist of 2015, Nine Electric. Hey, Ron, how you guys doing? Doing good. And <laughs> you said number two. Well, you know, sometimes you got to do that. <laughs> so how's this tour been going? Nine Electric. You have a new album. You're labeled up and you're out on the road. How's this thing going? It's been with a handful of label mates. Uh, Stitched Up Hard, who is on stage right now, uh, was with us the uh, pretty much the entire run. And Gemini Syndrome was the headliner. And it, it uh, we're all, at this point, we're old friends. We're all, we all kind of came up from the LA music scene. Right, right. And, um, it's been a blast. Everyone's album kind of came out around the same time, so there's like a bunch of hype around each band. It's been awesome. Yeah, and it looks like a lot of fun, and we've actually, uh, we're speaking with Aaron. We're going to catch up with them later in the month and stuff. But it's, you know, wherever you go, the crowd's there, and tonight, a free show. When the hell do you get a free show with a top-notch act like these guys? How did that, is that work out? The, the club, I don't know how they do it. They, Maybe they make some money on booze. I don't know. They just they throw these parties, man. See, you got to get to Vegas. Now, am I correct? This is the last night? This is it. This is the one. So what goes on after the show? Um, it's uh, clearly, I mean, there's, there's, there's plenty to choose from. It's, it's, it's going to be, I, I don't even know. Well, there won't I, be I, video. I have no, I have no commitments. But I'm just playing it by ear. Now, let's get into the new album. What was it like and what's the difference between recording an album and now being with the label and having that kind of support behind you? It, well, we we put out like our, our self-produced stuff was like, a, you know, a hand, like some bite-sized stuff, like like five song, six song EP. This is our first official release, so it's the full length, you know, it's, it's a little more incentive. People go, oh, let me check that out. But um, also we were able to, to work with like a, a big time producer, Kane Churko, who is actually based here. Correct. Uh, so um, we we tracked and recorded a lot of this stuff while we were on tour, through different tours in hotel rooms, sometimes in our our jam studio in L.A. Um, and we 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 gathered all that stuff up and then kind of handed it over to him, and he kind of did his final magic on it. And it, in fact, like it, just to give you an idea of how, what a badass he is, we sent him like a demo. That was the first thing we're like, he's like, let me see what I can do with this. And the demo ended up being like not retracked or anything. The demo is the title track off the album. It's the one we shot the music video for. It's like the big, like the single everyone's excited about. And um, it's, it just started out as like, you know, we're like, ah, these are throwaways. But it was just the, the magic he brought out of the mix and just how he was able to to bring out whatever it was on those tracks that maybe we overlooked or, you know what I mean? Oh, it just had a totally different, um, a different way of thinking about our music, you know what I mean? So, although he became kind of a fifth member as far as sensibilities and like putting his two cents in, um, it was a, such, such a whole new perspective we got on ourselves as a band working with this guy. So, and it but, turned out, I mean, we've heard this stuff and it is just some killer tunes. You guys got to pick that stuff up. Yeah, they like it. You know, how was it recording? You know, when you finally got all this stuff done and got it in? Because, well, you know, you were here in Vegas for a couple days right. doing some stuff. It, it was, it, that process was mostly like a, the finalizing phase, more of a mixing phase. So it, I would have liked to have spent more time with Kane and got, got more in depth. But just the way our schedules worked and just the timing of everything, we were like, okay, we got to put this thing out. We've got all this material. Let's just redeem what we have already started. And, you know, it's quick and put this out. So hopefully on the next record, we work with him from the ground up and really lay down some strong stuff. Uh, no. But I like, like I said, it was like recorded all over the U.S. in random truck stops and random, random sides of the road before we went on stage. Some of the tracks were laid down. So well, that's the only you know when you're on the road, that's the only time you really get to do stuff like that. Right. Unfortunately, you could because most of the time it's a handheld recorder. And hope I remember. That's it when right. I get home. Yeah, totally. Computer magic, you know. Oh, I do. Like, like all these fancy schmancy newfangled gadgets you got here. And the learning curve always, is insane. Always at the, the head of the curve, man. Well, with a little luck, you'll be seeing a live stream soon. Now, tonight, what do we expect to see? What's the set going to be like? Um, it's a long one, man. I like, like They have us up there for like over an hour, which uh, we on this tour, we were usually earlier on in the evening. So it was like, you know, half hour, 45 minute warm up set before the other band. Um, this time, it's uh, we're 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 the the big guys on stage, so we we're gonna bring out some of the stuff we don't know as well. 
So, the, you know, the back of my mind is like, shit, I hope I sing that shit right. Um, but also I'm excited because it's stuff that we haven't gotten to play for a few months. You know, and that's good because it's a nice long set. And it, with the crowd you have here and the crowd is here to see you guys, you're going to have a lot of fun. And they're, they're a pretty uh, fun bunch. So I expect a lot tonight. It's loud, man. It's any, awesome. Any surprises? Maybe. <laughs> You're gonna have to watch. I think, I think I think the whole night because it's it's the last day of the tour. It's the stuff that you kind of you know. Exactly. It's a throwaway in in so many ways. Like you can go a little ape shit. You can do some weird off the cuff things. Yes, like you ape can. Some of the other bands, like you know. Can, oh, the things I did go. on the last day of tours. <laughs> yeah, you you uh, know what I'm talking about. Oh, I've done stuff to people. Unfortunately, it's the last day, so you couldn't yeah, get me back. Got you, you like explosives or you know like just. I it's think, well, who was I with? I was out with a boy band, and I'm not scared to say that. I was doing yeah. a Backstreet Boys thing. And the last stop of the tour, we got like 3,000 ping pong balls and had them in a net and just rained on them. So cool. You know, what, they, they what did that it. sound like? Was that just too much to handle? You know, oh, it was. That tone? Fortunately, the sound guy pulled the faders oh, real quick because it was getting <laughs> ugly. Now, we got a couple quick questions we're going to end. But probably the most important question I could ask in any interview, what might we have left out about Nine Electric? They need to know. Oh, man. Okay, so brand new album out. Uh, it's available virtually everywhere. Um, we just did a music video for the title track. It is called The Damaged Ones. That's on and, YouTube right now, if I'm correct. Uh, it's not out yet. There there was like a pre, that's a pre what thing. I saw. It's, I saw it's, it's actually there. just, you know, a placeholder for that, the official video that's coming out. Um, yeah. So that, that should be hitting radio stations and things like that. So just just look out for us. Say hi on Facebook and all that shit. Mikey, our guitarist, actually runs the Facebook, so it's like it's up to date. It's up to the moment. The guy's obsessive, you know? And last time we talked, I think Mikey was here with us when we were talking yep, last yep. year. So that's a fun thing. Now, here's the thing we always do. We have a fun little game. I think we played it with you last year. It was called Roll the Bones. Oh, yeah. We had a 20-sided dice. This year, we changed it up. We found a 30-sided dice. Um, so we added 10 more questions. I think only four deal with music, but since trying to roll the dice out here is nearly impossible, pick a number between 1 and 30. All right, 24. 24, and 24 is what's in your refrigerator? What's in my refrigerator? <laughs> what? Is, oh, man. There's some... Uh, I'm trying to think. I, I just cleaned it out, and it was horrific. I can't remember what it was. Well, you've been on the road, so now it's moldy. Uh, yeah, yeah, and it wasn't mine. It was, uh, you know, it was our refrigerator. And uh, right now our generator's not working, so the RV is really hot. The, the refrigerator's working, so luckily it wasn't too bad. But I think it was, like, like way too old nachos. You know what I mean? They had become like a conglomerate of some other, like a third-party thing. Oh, like, yeah, something was moving in yeah, there when yeah. you to open it. It was alive. Okay, now I'm going to pick one. Unfortunately, I don't know the teen number, so I'm going to go 17. All right. Okay, why? Why the fuck not? <laughs> I love it. You know, that's the easiest one on that. Well, with all that, we're going to run. Let Ron get together with the boys, relax, you go on in about 45 minutes, then we're going to do some 360, some live streaming, have a lot of fun, but I appreciate everything, I got a piece of hardware to give you later, what? you're our you're number two artist of the year, there are, there's an oh, award yeah. that comes with that shit, <laughs> number two, you know? that still stokes me, well you know, beats being number three, that's, that's, <laughs> Nah, you guys were really, really great. We loved it. Thanks, man. So we'll see you soon. But for me, for Ron, for Nine Electric Buzz TV, Vamp Las Vegas, we're out of here, guys. See ya. Oh, my God, it's music again.